I will show you now how to minimize the amount of colors in the pattern. More time we spend on designing, less time we spend on stitching. I loaded the image which I'm converting. I used low parameters to make it a bit noisy. It's not easy to embroider because crosses are distanced. You would have to jump between them and undeliberately mix threads. I'm clicking the tool button and I have window with two lists. On the left side I have colors which have been used in the pattern and on the right I have all the colors on the top I have colors which have been used and on a darker background I have colors which I can use. I can increase a list of colors by clicking the plus button and adding DMC colors automatically all colors are selected but you can choose only a couple of them and after acceptance they will be added to your color list. I have 31 colors and pattern which is still noisy. And I want to make a pattern seamless. In my opinion brown color doesn't fit here and I want to change it to red. On the left list I've got some color selected but if I hold left alt and click left mouse button at brown cross that coral will appear on the left list if I do the same with holding alt again but clicking right mouse button the red cross color will appear on the right list How does it help us? On the left side I've got brown, on the right I've got red and I want everything to be red. If I click the highlighted button left coral will be replaced with the right color. Now I've got just 30 colors and brown colors have been replaced with red. I do the same with other colors which are in the pattern. Holding Alt and clicking left mouse button I'm choosing Ariadna 480 and with the right Ariadna 474 and change. Obviously we have other tools which are helpful in such a transformation. For example Conjure of the Devil is made with dark colors. It's black and I want it to be black and I'm clicking that cross and it's Ariadna 699 so it's black but here it's Ariadna 683 which is brown. What I can do now to change? I'm holding Alt and clicking that cross so it's on the left list and I will look for another colors which are most similar. Let's make it different cause you don't know how to get there yet. I'm selecting 699 and clicking the highlighted button and on to list I have two colors 678 and 699. Program says that 678 is most similar to 699. Some of the crosses has been replaced because it's automatically what program does. Now, now, if we choose the replacing tool, the less important color will be replaced. Let's do it again. I'm looking for the most similar color to 699. I'm clicking that button and it's 678 and I can replace it with 699 by clicking 
the button with arrow. That color is gone. I don't even remember what color it was. So now the amount of black crosses increased and one color is gone. In that way I'm minimizing the amount of colors. Why I'm looking for colors similar to 699? Because almost all pattern is in tingers of red, white and black. So I'm looking for all these similar colors to replace them with black. That list which appeared previously you can open this list by holding shift and clicking that button. Then we'll have the list of colors which are most similar to 699. Pay attention that on the left all colors are black. The pairs are sorted from the most similar to the least similar. If I click at the first pair, those colors will appear at my list in the main window. I can replace that 614 and I have one color less again. I can also search the most similar colors on that list by clicking that button. It will find two most similar colors in the own pattern. Program found two light colors. I can replace them, but actually I don't want them at all in my pattern. I'm holding shift and clicking that button because I want a pair of colors. I want white, but there is no white, so I have to add it to my list. Ariadna 400 in my pattern it's already white and the background is selecting with left alt clicking and I'm replacing it with white those buttons with squares are three main tools which allows us to minimize color amount. There is one more tool, the last one. If I arrange the list by amount of colors after clicking that button the last color will be removed and replaced with the most similar it's automatically. If you want to know if that color is important, we can check it in display options by clicking display one color and it will appear on the screen where it is. It's not important so I can erase it. Automatically the next least important color is choosing. So we'll see where it is and etc etc so we can eliminate quickly in a while we'll have just couple colors so it will be easier to embroider it it's what I wanted to achieve monochromatic background, monochromatic contour and extra added elements are also monochromatic now I will just correct contour with a pencil tool to make it exactly black and I can say that pattern is ready. Thank you for all attention.